The Israel Defense Forces IDF, has posted footage of its operation to strike targets in Hamas underground metro network. IDF said it struck 50 targets and damaged many kilometers of the tunnel system 160 aircraft, tanks, artillery and infantry IDF units were deployed along the border. Israel strikes Gaza. Tunnel system confusion and chaos reigned between Israel and the Gaza Strip on Friday with reports of attacks on both sides and an increasing number of casualties, especially in Gaza. The Israeli army reported that it had sent 160 aircraft into the Strip to destroy a network of tunnels operated by Hamas, the Islamist party that controls the region. Army spokesperson Jonathan Kenrick has stressed that while tanks supported the airstrikes from Israeli territory during the mission, no Israeli troops set foot inside Gaza as previously reported the Israeli military tweeted math. Many kilometers of the tunnel system had been damaged. The operation also targeted a number of launch sites and observation posts. The tunnel network is vital in the Gaza Strip for shifting goods and people in and out since Israel maintains tight restrictions on the region. So long as it is ruled by Hamas, a group has real classifies as terrorist, in which has a history of armed resistance to Israeli rule. The two sides have entered another phase of aggression after growing tensions about access to holy sites in Jerusalem and efforts that possibly forced some Palestinian residents from their homes in East Jerusalem. Israel relies on its Iron Dome missile defense system to deal with those that pose a threat. It claims that it has been about 90% effective in stopping missiles this week. The United Nations, meanwhile, sounded alarm about the humanitarian situation in the Gaza Strip calling for the border to be opened to transport, petrol and humanitarian. The border was shut on May 10 on the Israeli side. An Egyptian delegation that met with Israeli officials to help negotiate a ceasefire did not reach any positive results an Egyptian security source said on Friday.